great um sunday I was fixing uh fish nets this morning with thane now i'm done there for the day so working on this now my plunger is kind of stuck moved a little bit um oh starting to hail <clears throat> starting to hail or something out here now bit of old hay left in it i got that out everything's like really wet and cruddy in here right over there it's hard to see but there's a stick stuck in there so i think that's kind of one of my biggest problems so i don't know if i can get that moved out of there or not I'm definitely gonna try uh so i guess i'll let this dry out some I have to get in there with my grinder, shine her up a bit, see if I can get that stick knocked out of there. There's the other piece of it. So, all right, ah. All right, I think I'll go grab something to eat. It's like 20 after one, something like that. Maybe one o'clock, I don't know. Right, we'll do that, let this hail stop and, uh, See if I can get this thing freed up and rolling. Well, so got in there, uh, kind of hit everything with some penetrating oil as best I could. So, um, uh, Probably gonna see if I can't get a bit of a chainsaw bar oil in there too, just to kind of help it along because it is pretty cruddy. Find some rags or something, clean them up better. Yeah. See, once I can get that to move some, free it up. I got that stick pushed back. I don't know if I can get it out or not, but for right now it doesn't seem to be jamming it up any. So that's the problem here. It's just all credit up, right? So yeah, I keep messing with it and hopefully I can get things uh moving good. So if anybody has any advice, advice for uh help me out here, uh Please tell me in the comment section because this is kind of all new to me. All right. Hey, uh, trying to get the plunger back with that big ass stick. Kind of looking at the gap there in the knife. I think it is kind of going slowly. Yeah. Not going to need to go to the gym and I'm done this today, I'll tell you. My God, it is going. It's opening up in there. Yeah. All right. Keep cleaning and head and lube and uh, keep beating and thrashing. All right. I get some progress here. Oh, my there we go. She's moving now. All right. Well, we'll keep working at this. Hopefully soon. We can have the tractor moving that back and forth. Man, I tell you, what a job. Ugh. All right. there's a bit of a hump in that rail so uh 
kind of see a wear line back there a ways. So I think what I'm going to do is get in there with my grinder. Just kind of buff that down. Take a little bit off it. I think this side's okay. I think that's where my problem is. So, we're starting to rain again. Anyway, the way this day's going. Alright, so, I'm going to get geared up and there's my grinder. And hopefully I don't get stuck in this bell chute. Rain stopped. Sun's out again. Got that little sanding disc thing on there, so now it's time to get in there and start doing some buffing. Probably have to put a grinding wheel on and get that slider rail thing <coughs> ground down a little, possibly. If I have to, that's what I'll do. But for now, I'll just see if I can't shine that up some in there. better than it was so I think I am gonna put a grinding disc on it's gonna hit that rail right there um, so I'm pretty sure that's where my problem is so I'm just kind of guessing here, but it does look like there's a bit of a hump there, so kind of see where it's been stopping. Uh, anyway, say so that sanding disc done pretty good, so now I'll put a grinding disc on and give that a bit of a hit. Got it turning. Guess that's the main thing for right now. Um, definitely gonna need some fine tuning. But it's all in all, it was a good afternoon. So I'm just gonna end this here and yeah, I'm just gonna take it easy for the rest of the day. Well, not much left of the day, it's like 5 30 in the afternoon. All right, so hopefully this is uh, on its way to a good haying season this summer.